This is my worship. This is my offering. In every moment, I withhold nothing. I'm learning to trust you, even when I can't see it, and even in suffering. I have to believe it. If you say it's wrong, then I'll say no. If you say release, I'm letting go. If you're in it with me, I'll begin. And you say to jump, I'm diving in. If you say be still, then I will wait. If you say to trust, I will obey. Don't wanna follow my own ways. I'm done chasing feelings. Spirit, lead me. Spirit, lead me. It felt like a bird. Don't chase 
just lift up our intercessory prayers for those who are listed in our prayer list. I have to say as a pastor for all the years I was a pastor I was rarely on the list myself <laughs> as I am today. Appreciate your prayers for me. Uh, we haven't been here in a while. Uh, as many of you know I've been uh, I'm under treatment with a non-Hodgkin lymphoma and so my blood counts have been a little down so uh, one reason why I didn't serve communion today as well. So Anyway, appreciate your prayers for me as well as all the other folks that are on this list for whatever reason. So let us join together in prayer. Lord, we are so grateful that we can pray for each other uh, and that our prayers really do make a difference. And so I personally, oh God, am grateful for the prayers of my sisters and brothers in this congregation, uh, that uh, prayers for my healing, prayers of love and support and we offer those same prayers for all the other folks on this list today oh god touch them with your healing grace and power for for their bodies if it's physical uh healing that they need for uh their spirit if it's spiritual healing that they need their relationships if it, that is what they need and just whatever their need is oh god we pray that you would be at work in their lives and and show us, oh God, where we can put feet to our prayers as well. And so we just lift them all up to you. And we, as we continue to pray, we pray that prayer that Jesus taught his disciples to pray when he said, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. And now, would you receive this blessing and benediction? Go out from this place, uh, walking in the power and presence of the Holy Spirit in your lives. Uh, just call upon Him to fill your life so that you may be a blessing to others and we uh, and remember that you are a part of a great company of those not only here in this place but around the world as you go an army of God to uh, to touch others in the name of Jesus go in peace in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit amen we say one other thing before you leave uh, as Pastor Jason did, I know last week, if you want to linger today and you'd like somebody to pray with you, uh, Karen and I'll be down here uh, just to pray with you if you have a specific need. I have my oil. I can We can anoint you with oil. So if, if that's something you would like to do today, feel free to just linger in the sanctuary and come see us. No. Testing.